Okay, I've got a property update for you. This one's going to be short and sweet because I'm sticking in these two flats. Nothing has changed this week anywhere else. So um, we're just in these two flats here. This is the bedroom for the um, left-hand side flat as you're looking at the building. And as you can see, there's plenty of room for a, a double bed between there and there. Space to walk around, wardrobe in the corner. The double bed will only come to here so you can walk all the way around. Um, space for more wardrobes in this corner if, if needed. Uh, going through this space here, we've got the place where there will be a washing machine here, a water tank here, and a header tank up there. So again, that's all boxed in and ready. All of the first fix electrics are in, and um, most of the first fix plumbing. Actually, I could probably say all of the first fix plumbing, because it's one of those ones where actually um, some of the plumbing will just go, it would just be straight in, because uh, that, that kitchen here, which is on this, this wall here, um, that will go in and be plumbed up direct. So. In this room, quite a nice sized bathroom, there'll be um, a toilet pan there, sink here, and a bath going across there. The waste for the um, washing machine will come through underneath the bath. There'll be an access panel so you can get through to the whole lot. Reduce the height of the ceiling ever so slightly. It comes to that level there with a, a waterproof light in it. So it's um, uh, you know, not not too high and not, not too low. Got a space above it and we can put uh, the extractor fan and all the electrics below it, uh, above it and that kind of stuff as well. Uh, the kitchen goes from there to there it's a corner kitchen so it only comes to this uh, uh, line there that's um, uh, 600 wide and to there again so it's a corner kitchen leave your space for chairs there which then leaves your space for sofas on this bit and uh, you know TV and that kind of stuff they'll put all the sockets in for TV and those kind of things this um, it's got all the tools and stuff in it. it's a bit messy in here but uh, that's because all the other rooms being cleared out because they're plastering it and then they'll do vice versa in this room here all the plaster is going on that's got a, that's got a big window going in that wall uh, which is arriving in the next couple of days all this room's plastered uh, that ceiling needs to be plastered right way up top that's a bit of a patch plaster that's fireboard and that'll be plastered over there this is the cupboard where all the and uh, the gubbings for the, uh, the the water tank goes in there so that'll be properly uh, plastered over but that pipe needs to go through there that will have a new floor going in there so all that mess will be hidden and it'll be painted out inside so it will be the decorative finish will be nice because it is going to be part of the flat uh, in this space here um all the electrics are in for the kitchen as you can see there that's being plastered round, but then these walls there to be plastered today. That guy's going to be hitting pretty much all of these walls today. It's only a day's job to plaster both these things out. So all around there to be plastered. And then if I go through to the kitchen, uh, so the bathroom, we're just prepping in there for um, plaster as well. So that's the, that's the next room to be plastered in this room then all the materials come into this room and then they'll plaster through into the other flat so um it's coming on really well um another couple of weeks and we'll have got kitchens bathrooms flooring in and we'll be on to the decorative finishes this little um lobby area is again all going to be plastered out decorated and uh, made good um the doors to be changed <coughs> and um it, it's going to look nice from this point forwards and hopefully we'll be able to get somebody to rent this one and this one while we carry on doing the work in the rest of uh, the building the next two flats to be done are the two flats above this um because they're they're empty now and we can we can access them both uh, so that's another three to four weeks after this job um and by that time the other two people are, are still living in the block will uh, will have gone and we can get on with the whole rest of it uh, i can put another three guys on the team if i were to do that now we'd just run out of work to be honest so there's no point in doing that now um give, give it another uh three weeks four weeks from now i can put another two or three guys on the team and get the uh, get the job speed up a little bit and finish the other four flats hopefully a little bit quicker than we've done these four flats once the people have moved out so that's the end of the update hope everything makes sense it's looking good to me i'm uh, pleased with progress we've made a few little decisions this morning about socket positions and number of units for the kitchen and where they go exactly just to maximize the space there's always one or two little finer details but actually when you're actually on site you think well i could just push that a little bit and get a bit better there so i'm happy everything's a, a good use of the space and uh yeah coming on well so that is the end of the update